welcome back to another vlog i'm doing this intro really quick i just finished filming my chit chat get ready with me that's why your girl is serving a look today but i am on my way out of the door so i will be on time and i'm going to meet the girls for brunch at negro atl so let me go ahead get myself together get in the car and i'll talk to y'all on the way there i'm so freaking hungry <laughs> I had to go pay for parking. Oh, my straw is stuck right here. All right, let me get in here. Oh, she looks nice. Hi. That was your friend. up earlier this morning right and I was on my phone this whole time and Charlie just nestled his way into my bed and now that I'm ready to get up he don't want to get up out the bed y'all this is like a regular occurrence for Charlie <laughs> and you know I know he's up because I can see his little ear poking up right there but he wants to act like he doesn't want to get up y'all watch this watch come on weenie oh now he want to oh now you want to get up Now you want to get up. I'm talking to you. You're so cute. I did not make my bed this morning. Don't come for me, okay? I'm about to head out the house. It's about 8 o'clock now. I'm going to head out a little early because after church, me and my family are going to this barbecue spot called Fox's Barbecue. And, um... They're going to ride in my car on the way there. So I wanted to I wanted to do this anyway because my plan was to go to the beach today. But I'll probably just go next weekend because I just I'm not going to have time today. So um, because I have to start getting ready for the work week. So since I'm not going to the beach, um, my whole plan was to do like a summer reset situation where I get my car summer ready all this stuff y'all but I'm gonna still get my car summer ready <laughs> so that's what I'm gonna do right now I'm on my way to the car wash the self-clean car wash y'all know I love that car wash as well so I'm gonna go over there just do a really quick washing of my car and then I'm gonna show you guys the Amazon items that I got for my car and I'll have them linked for you guys but y'all they are so cute so we're gonna put everything together get my car clean and fresh so um my family can be nice and comfortable and that way we can be pre-ready for the beach next weekend so that is what we are doing y'all I for sure needed like an extra two hours of sleep okay I did not feel like getting up out of the bed this morning and you know how like those mornings where the temperature is just right in your room, you know what I'm saying? Like you're freshly showered from the night before, you're crispy, you're cool, no noises, undisturbed, like that kind of sleep, y'all. That's the kind of sleep I had last night, y'all. But I had to get my butt up to go to church. I'm not doing any makeup today. I'm literally, this is what I'm doing. I just don't feel like putting makeup on and I'm just gonna let my hair kind of be like a, messy wave and that is what we're doing i just have this um this is the the uh bodysuit that i showed y'all in the last vlog yeah in the last vlog that's going up tomorrow so this is the bodysuit and i'm just pairing it with my jeans and i'm gonna put my clogs on again so that's what i'm wearing today y'all see the difference remember when i bought this in the last vlog y'all see the difference between the condition side and the non-condition side y'all look so much better
that took longer than expected y'all i changed my glasses out by the way i felt like the black ones were a little too dark <sighs> y'all i'm running a little behind today but that's okay my car is cleaned out and i'm on my way to starbucks and then i'm gonna head on in to church i'm gonna be late today to church but that is okay as long as i attend because by the time i get there they should be into the word so that's really all that matters and then like i said after that me and the fam are gonna go to barbecue y'all apparently this is supposed to be like one of the best barbecue spots in atlanta so i'm really excited to try it out and see how it is i have not had haven't had the only decent barbecue spot around in my opinion that i've been to so far is jim and nick's every time i go their barbecue and brisket and all that is pretty decent but i haven't had like a good down home cooking barbecue so we shall see how this goes for 4th of July weekend but I wanted to catch y'all up because I feel like I didn't talk about the last few clips so we went to Negro Village it's a Jamaican restaurant in Atlanta I would definitely go again but the hiccup was it was four of us and they have a system where you have to pay on one tab but the kicker is they don't itemize your specific items so basically one person has to pay <laughs> for everyone who is at the table unless y'all manually calculate exactly how much your meal was plus your gratuity and your taxes <laughs> so it was a whole lot a whole lot of so i would definitely go again if it was just me or if i was going like on a date or something like that with just one other person but i would not recommend going if you have a large group of people and then on sunday me and my family went out to dinner after church or lunch after church at fox bros barbecue and it was good it was really good i would give it a nine out of ten everything to me was really good everyone liked their food the only thing we didn't care for was the potato salad but everything else was pretty good i would definitely go back i do have two other barbecue spots that i want to check out so yeah but me and charlie are packed up we are on our way to my sister's house like i said we're just gonna chill i'm gonna cook on sunday cook the sides they're gonna put some meat on the grill we're gonna do fireworks the whole shebang so i packed up i did some cleaning today before i left out packed up my bags i'm running late i was supposed to be there already i told her i would be there like five six o'clock it's seven o'clock and i'm just now heading down the road so yeah <laughs> but i had to get my drink okay it's a whole hour and a half drive so i had to get my drink so that is what we are doing but you guys i finished stranger things last night oh and i wasn't gonna do it until next weekend but i couldn't help it i couldn't resist y'all it was so good it was so good see stranger things is that show and i am now like a diehard fan for eddie munson like y'all when he did that guitar solo y'all my heart melted when i saw that guitar solo piece and then to find out that the actor jamie quinn was actually playing the guitar y'all like i cannot i cannot exaggerate i literally played that scene at least 15 times y'all <laughs> it was just so good it was so good the song the background the scene of it all y'all it was just so so good like to me for me that was the highlight of the the show they did a phenomenal job with the writing it was just really good y'all let me know what y'all thought about season four of stranger things i was a little salty i thought they were going to have like more episodes but they gave us, you know, a good four hours worth of footage to watch. So I cannot complain. Um, and yeah, I cannot wait for season five. I'm assuming, I don't know. I'm assuming season five will be the end. I don't know. You shall see. But 
really, really good. I will check in with y'all later tonight or tomorrow. My plan is to take my hair out tonight so I can wash my hair in the morning and install a new wig a subscriber sent over. So I'm gonna try out her wig. So that's my plan to take my take down my hair tonight. My sister wants to watch Peyton because Peyton posted a new video and I haven't I haven't been watching anybody for a second. So we're gonna get caught up on Peyton's vlogs tonight, take down my hair and see my hair is filthy I've had these plaits in for a month and a half but I did wash them in between like I kept the plaits in but I washed them my hair feels good it's nice and moisturized and it smells good but my scalp is just really really dry and y'all know like I have I don't want to say scalp issues but my scalp is always really dry so I'm going to let me tell y'all my whole plan so y'all know I'm at my sister's house right or her house is you know cute or whatever so my plan is to have a full take full advantage okay and have a full self-care weekend so this is like a fourth of july weekend slash staycation situation for me <laughs> so i'm about to wash my hair really good and then i'm going to shave and then later on tonight i'm going to take a nice bath and have like a whole self-care situation so that's what we're doing it's around 12 o'clock now and earlier this morning i went to walmart to get some last minute ingredients for tomorrow and we've just been lounging around so i'm about to wash my hair and put some twists in my some flat twists in my hair and we're gonna go down to Columbus to um, just take a look around because that's like the biggest city closer to her area. And I've never been to Columbus. So that is the plan. But I'm just gonna detangle my hair really quick before I wash it. I'm gonna use the Joyco system. I've been using this for like a year now. And I really do love these products. My hair loves them. So I use the shampoo and conditioner. And then I put in the reconstructing spray so that's what i'm gonna use on my hair but before i use that i do go in with my selsun blue medicated shampoo and this is the moisturizing one and that does help with my scalp and then like i said i'm gonna do my little shaving situation i'm gonna exfoliate the whole nine and i do want to try out this new body wash that i got so yeah y'all that is the name of the game. Oh, she's cute. 
Hey y'all, today is Saturday, y'all. It's like two weeks, maybe three weeks later from the last time I started filming. Um, I just left Shawnice, as y'all can tell, honey. She laid it down. She laid it down. She put some curls in this time. Y'all know normally I don't do curls, but I was like, let me do some curls. And it looks so cute. It looks so cute, y'all. If you need your hair done, go to Shawnice. And she was telling me a lot of y'all be going to her referred from me so i'm so happy that y'all are supporting her because she is an awesome stylist but i'm on my way to meet Brittany for lunch we're going to seasons 52 i've never been so we're going over there for lunch to catch up and yeah y'all after that i'm bringing my booty back home I have to restart my camera but yeah after that i'm bringing my booty back home because i have so much that i need to do i need to edit this video to go up i need to clean y'all have a whole lot a whole lot to do so after i get back home i'm staying home and getting my home together and then um tomorrow i'm gonna go to church and you know do the regular teens but i wanted to pick up the camera and catch up with y'all i've been vlogging so i will have another work vlog up before this video goes up but i had to get on camera to show y'all my hair because it just looks so good this is the unit that i got from eunice and this is what it looks like installed and curled so yeah y'all y'all i'm so crusty today like i literally i was about to do a full face of makeup because i knew i was getting my hair done and i knew i was going to meet britney for lunch but y'all this morning i was just not feeling it so i was just like look my hair is going to be done so that will give me a look okay because y'all know when you first get your hair done hello when you first get your hair done it be looking so good that you don't really need to do anything else but have your hair done put a cute little outfit on so that's what we're doing today it is hot y'all it is so freaking hot I think 
and I like watching that one but that's not one I can put on in the background because I like to be attentive when I'm watching that show so I can see like what the tea is and what's going on but that's a really good show too on Discovery Plus but when I'm trying to get stuff done and I just need something on in the background that I can still watch but I'm not paying attention to I'll put on Seinfeld so yeah y'all that is what I'm about to do on this Saturday by the way I didn't give y'all the update on how the food was y'all food was bomb.com I was telling Brittany like this is our new spot <laughs> this is our new spot because we're both trying to be health conscious and lose weight and all that y'all y'all gonna have to wait yeah we're both trying to be health conscious and lose weight and all of that so everything on the menu at seasons 50 what what are y'all what right okay <laughs> but everything at the menu on seasons 52 is under 595 calories so if you guys are wanting to eat out but you're trying to be more health conscious about you know what you're putting in your body and all that i would highly recommend y'all every single thing that i ordered was good it was so good so i ordered the crab cake as a starter delicious fresh it was giving the seasonings it was giving the taste the flavor and then i got the shrimp and grits of course for my entree palm.com and the whole entree like i said under 595 calories y'all i feel like that was probably the best the best shrimp and grits that i've had like that's like my new number one it was so good so so good yeah, and then i got the scallops they have like a side of scallops that you can get on the side got that too fresh it was giving it was giving so i got that and for dessert i ordered the key lime pie and i love it because everything <sighs> y'all are really gonna get me today y'all are really gonna get me but i love it because everything is portion controlled correctly like I don't know if I took video of it but they had a tower of the desserts and that size is how the actual dessert comes and that's all you need y'all that is all you need because you know how restaurants be giving you that big old piece of cake and all that I love this restaurant so we said this is our new spot like we will be coming back as regulars to eat there because it was just giving everything it needed to give and my tab for all that food crab cake scallops entree and dessert and i had sweet tea was um 65 dollars y'all remember in the last vlog when i went to that restaurant in marietta my tab was like over 80 dollars and the food wasn't giving so i would highly recommend seasons 52 